Hello, hello guys, welcome to Zaim TV. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. This is Zaim TV. Welcome to Zaim TV. So, guys, hello to Naizakonga Kusu online prank. The online pranks that we normally do as Zaim TV, before normally known as Amran TV. Tungependa kwa Julisha too, the online pranks ziko na advantage na disadvantage. The pranks that you see in the social media, the pranks that you see on the roads, some are staged, some are real. So it depends, depend on yourself as a person who views the prank. But most cases, most pranks are staged. So we'll ex I'll explain to you today regarding to the online pranks that we normally do as Zaim TV, before known as Amran TV. So guys, we know that the pranks for us as content creators, Nikitunzuri, for us it's something that is good because it creates content, it makes people laugh. But what, what about the person, what about the person that is being pranked? Is he ready for the prank? You know we have the disadvantage and advantage of the online pranks or any prank in the social media. So today we've decided to talk about disadvantage and advantage. Because for the content, the online pranks, for the content it makes our viewers laugh, it makes our people enjoy, but for the person who's made who the prank is on him or her do you think that the prank will be good or bad it depends now with the person the prank is on you it might have disadvantage and advantage the first advantage it may cause panic yeah for example now i just call you and be like you are needed at a, a certain station maybe you've done a crime you may you might have a panic or a, a heart attack so today i've come to address the issue of the content creation of uh, the online pranks on or the pranks at large so it has its own advantage and it has its own disadvantage it depends on who do you prank and what is the prank about it depends on yourself because at the end of the road, the prank on the content creation tears a benefit on the content creator because he's pranking you to make people happy, make people laugh. But the other side of the disadvantage is that the online pranks or the any prank, it makes somebody, first of all, to have a panic. It might, it might lead to a heart attack. It depends on yourself now and it depends on the person who's being pranked. That's why we say most of them are staged, something planned to make people laugh. Some are real that make even people have heart attack. And most cases the staged pranks are good for health more than the one ambushed on the road. It depends now. Because for most cases, the online pranks which are staged are healthy-wise good compared to those pranks that uh, are just on the street. So it's upon yourself to check who are you pranking, what time are you pranking, and what is the topic of the prank? What is the, what is the aim of the prank? For example, you're pranking somebody, maybe he's being fired by his company. Or maybe he has stolen money, some cash from somebody. The person can, can take you to court. Or somebody can just call you and be like, he want to blackmail you. So at the end of the road, you are the one who will be suffering as the content creator. Now it depends. It depends on... Uh, the content that you want to make, the prank. 
most cases the staged prank are very very nice but most of the people want most of our viewers and our customers want non-staged content creators it's non-staged online pranks or any prank whatsoever in the social media but uh, for me i can advise it's healthy for staged pranks or online pranks more than the non-staged because the one which is you are being ambushed at the street it has its own disadvantage and advantage it depends now it depends now with yourself it depends it depends a lot with yourself it depends a lot with yourself because at the end of the road it's you yourself because for me as a content creator I'm making content for people to view, people to laugh, people to be happy. We have a lot of people who are facing a lot of stress outside here. So whenever we make any content, we make any prank, we make any interview, it's for our viewers, for the benefit of our viewers. But on the other side, we need also to check the people who are being pranked. Are, are they happy? Are they willing to be pranked? Because you can't just call somebody and prank somebody and maybe he, he maybe he's in certain panic mode. Then at the end of the road it may cause harm for that person. It depends now with that person. Now, for example, now when we make a content and maybe somebody gets a panic or heart attack, at the end of the road it may lead for serious injuries or serious penalties. Because the moment when you make the moment when you make an online prank or a normal prank and somebody gets a heart attack or anything, it has its own disadvantage and advantage. Because uh, people love reality content. People love content that are real. But at the end of the road, the reality content are not easy to be done, more than the stage content. Because the reality content, it is based on reality. If it is slapping, you need to slap somebody real. If it is staged, we know how to do it. But you see, at the end of the road, as long as the content that our viewers and our subscribers can be happy watching our content. But for the online pranks and normal pranks, we must make sure who do we prank, what time do we prank, and what is the topic of the prank. You can prank just somebody anyhow. At the end of the road, you might yourself you, you find yourself in a problem. It depends, guys. It depends a lot. It depends on how do you prank, what do you prank. And who do you prank? If it's your friend, it's fine. If just a normal stranger, he can he can even take you to court. Yeah. After that, he will he will come and realize that it was just a prank. Just it was just a content. But maybe for your friend or your family or your relative, it's good to go. But at the end of the road, if you sit down and realize like, oh, you have messed up, the law will take its course. So we must be very, very careful on the content that you are making, especially the online pranks and the normal pranks. It may cause harm to somebody else. It depends now with who do you prank and what do you prank and what time do you prank. You can prank somebody in the midnight, he is asleep. You can prank somebody in the morning, he is still on bed. Yeah. Because this, uh, the stage pranks are more suitable than the ambush prank. It depends now on, on, on the disadvantage and advantage of online pranks and the pranks. It depends now on yourself, guys. So, if you have not subscribed to Zaim TV, we at TikTok, kindly make sure watch and subscribe to our YouTube channel Zaim TV for more episodes to come guys see you